This picture on the left here, do a quick, is a picture of DNA and your RNA. Now, if you want to conceptualize this, your DNA is a hard drive, and your RNA is something that comes in and copies the hard drive. It doesn't actually work like a copy, or there's a, a whole splitting thing that happens, but this is a good way to think about it. And then, around your DNA, you have something called a regulatory protein sleeve. Uh, this is the way Bruce Lipton describes it, which is probably the easiest, most accessible way that I've found. And there's a notion of something called the exposome. The exposome is the set of all the things that are around us that affect us over the course of our life. The toxins you're exposed to, what kind of light were you exposed to? Was it sunny in Phoenix or was it rainy in Victoria? That actually affects your genetic expression. What food did you eat? What exercise did you get? What toxins were in your food or in the air or in the environment? And what emotions were you feeling? Did you have stress? Were you afraid at school? Were you happy at school? Did you feel challenged at school? Did you feel bored at school? It actually changes your expression of genes because this regulatory protein sheath changes on a second-by-second -second basis based on your environment. Which means if you get these things in the middle right, you can actually change what genes get expressed. And when you reproduce, that passes on to the next generation. That's pretty powerful stuff.